Hey everyone, it's John again, and today I'm just taking a little bit of a break from the CCMP Switch series, which I'm doing just to effectively give you a free packet tracer file. Now, I used to make these quite frequently when I use packet tracer quite a lot, and it's obviously quite a large apology. And I remember on Cisco's, or well, I think it was packet tracer, Cisco's packet tracer, packet tracer might have our Facebook page, I can't remember either which way it was a Cisco Facebook page, and they encourage you to post your packet tracer topologies. So I would post like some of these topologies in a a JPEG image and I would quite frequently get PMs on Facebook asking if I could share the files. So I thought, Do you know what, some people seem to like these files so maybe I'll just put it up on my YouTube page and see if anyone wants to download them. So basically, if you've got a use for any of these kind of files then give me feedback, like the video, all that subscribe stuff. <laughs> um, not trying to beg for any kind of likes or whatnot, but it does tell me if this is worth my time to actually do these, because they're not actually too difficult to create, but they do take a bit of time. But if you think it's worth it, and I think there's enough interest, then I'll make more of them, obviously. Uh, they're not too difficult to do. And like I say, these are not really designed with anything in mind. It's just a way to kind of um, integrate different technologies. So like, you see here, I've got a frame relay cloud here, and I've got um, uh, access lists, and I've got some voice over IP, and uh, OSPF stuff and just quite a lot of different technologies interacting. We've got virtual links and whatnot. Like I say, that's not really a best practice to put a virtual link there, but it's just to help you see how the technology integrates. So, like I say, I'll just do a quick demonstration of some of the stuff you can do in this topology and by all means take it, break it, change it, make it your own, do what you want with it. And like I say, if you want to see more of these uh, topologies uploaded for you, then just like the video or leave a comment and say, you know what, these are useful, we want more and it's no problem at all, I'll make more for you. So like I say, this is just a, um, if we go into the, some of the devices and just do a basic show run, you can see we've got a bunch of um, access lists on this one and so on and so forth and um, say for example on this one, show run, We've got some DHCP stuff, spanning two priorities, HSRP, um, what have we got over here? We've got an, an IPv6 over IPv4 tunnel con configured on this one. Just some tunnel stuff. DHCP, IPv6. So, like I say, and if you want to just try it out, it's quite it's quite a bit of fun if you like to play with big topologies. So I'll just do some demonstration. So IP config. This isn't an IP address, so I'll just IP config renew. And we should get one from the VLAN we're in, so we can ping the default gateway. What I will say is sometimes the pings run kind of slow in this because Packet Tracer is kind of a bit under stress when it gets topologies are kind of large like this. Um, ping 200, 00. zero. Do you know what I mean? It kind of holds a little bit. And then you eventually start getting your replies through. Um, let's have a wee look. What have we got over here? Let's grab an IP address to ping. So we'll ping this one 8814.2. And I'll do it from... Say so ping it right across the network. And actually if you want to see the actual simulation of that, I can do the same thing again. And we'll see the packet, there's a packet there. And if we just play, you'll see it actually moving across the network. And it goes. Move over here a little bit. Now we're going over the frame relay. There we go. And then zip over the optical, there we go, and down over to the ISPs, and down, and then it's going to take its path all the way back in the return traffic. So 
So that's pretty much it. Do you know what I mean? I've got all these little things set up. There's some wireless stuff. There's some different VLANs, Slack. Um, you've got your IP phones configured here. Um, so if I did... This is number 5403. So if I did 5400... Uh, zero, zero, I'll take it off that, rather. I'll hang that up and do it again. So 54002. Zero, zero, Let me click this one. This one's ringing. You can see it flashing there. And now it's connected. Hang up. So we've got voice over IP, lots of different stuff. And like I say, that's just it. There's not really much to this video. It's just a free file to share. So if you want to download the file, just look in the description and I'll have a Dropbox link for you to download freely. And like I say, if you want more of these, like the video and I'll know to make more of them because like I say, they're not difficult to make for me, but they do take a bit of time. So if it's worthwhile, then I'll do some more for you. Okay, doc, so that's the end of the video. In the next one, we'll get back to the actual CCMP Switch video and I'll see you guys soon. Okay, doc, so thanks very much and bye-bye.